what's up everybody g here vp of content fitnessinformant.com here today for another review today we are looking at total iso from cutler nutrition this is a simple whey protein isolate product from you know none other than jay cutler his line of products we've been enjoying his other products this one not much different so either way let's not waste your time let's get into the profile effectiveness taste mixability value and let you know if we liked it or not let's go Okay, so as the name states, it's a simple whey protein isolate. Isolate protein is a form of whey protein that has been stripped down even more so than concentrate. Gets rid of a lot of the cholesterol, a lot of the, the lactose and sugar in there, as well as a lot of the fat, which is why the macros on here are pretty low when compared to your basic whey protein concentrate. The macros per scoop are as follows. One gram of fat, two grams of carbs, and 24 grams of protein, less than five milligrams of cholesterol. So overall, it's a very lean source of protein. This is, you, this is probably best for people who have issues digesting whey protein concentrate um, or people who want to you know, kind of cut out a little bit of fat, extra fat and sugar uh, in comparison to a whey protein concentrate. Other than that, uh, when you do use a whey protein isolate, you do kind of get rid of some of the benefits of whey protein, protein concentrate, the immunoglobulins. Uh, it's a little bit more stripped down, as I stated, but honestly, you could, it doesn't really make a difference in the long run. You're just getting a little less of the fat and sugar. Other than that though, there's not really too much in here. We, we could do without the corn syrup solids, but if you're getting less than a gram of sugar in here, which we believe there is, then it's not really gonna make a difference even in the long run, but that's just something we thought we'd point out. Either way, solid profile. It's on par with a lot of other isolates on the market. All right, so the effectiveness of a protein powder is a little bit hard to judge. You can really only base it off of the digestion. It's not gonna magically put on muscle. Honestly, it's just convenience food. That's how I look at protein powder. It's just a very convenient source of protein. Would you rather eat a chicken breast eight times a day or eat a couple of those and supplement with or take a few protein shakes instead? So with that said, our user, including which we had three users on this, this was Ryan, Danielle, and me. Uh, I had no issues digesting it. Ryan and Danielle didn't have any issues digesting it. That's to be expected with a whey protein isolate. With that said, uh, the three of us, as far to my knowledge, uh, we don't have issues with dairy. If you have issues with dairy, this is probably the one to go with if you want to still supplement with whey because a concentrate may, you may be more prone to the gassiness, the bloating. All right, let's get into the taste. Uh, we had three flavors sent to us. We had, we're going by the cocoa cereal flavor. The other two uh, flavors that I know of are the fruity cereal as well as the cinnamon cereal. So this taste, uh, part of the review is gonna be a little bit different. I had mine, Danielle had hers, and Ryan had his. Uh, this is certainly on the sweeter side. Uh, so how it went, me, I liked it, but it had to be the right situation. Sometimes I want something really sweet. Uh, Danielle, she really liked it. She enjoyed it. She could use it as a staple, well, at least according to Ryan. And Ryan was not the biggest fan of the taste. He said it was all right, but it was too much on the sweet side for him to use like every day, uh, which I kind of agree with, just I didn't hate it as much as he did, or hate, dislike. But either way, it's good. If you like sweeter proteins, this is a good one to go with, especially with the low sugar in there. It could certainly satisfy anybody's sweet tooth. As for the other flavors, uh, the fruity cereal is also pretty sweet. As, and the cinnamon cereal, it's not really, it kind of tastes too much like a cinnamon product, not necessarily cereal, uh, necessarily cereal. It's more of like a cinnamon flavored protein, if that makes sense. That could use a little bit more sweetness. Other than that, they are pretty good, especially the, the uh, cocoa cereal, if you're gonna choose one, we'd probably suggest this one or maybe the fruity cereal. The cinnamon cereal could use a slight bit of work, but still, none of them are bad and they're very drinkable. Okay, so now we get to the mixability of this protein. Uh, with it being an isolate, you, you're not gonna like get any clumping really. Concentrate, sometimes you have issues with mixing. Isolates, not so much. Okay, so we're shaking it up, we are pouring it in, and as you see, there's no clumping to speak of. One thing we did have to note though, is that this is a little bit thicker than your standard whey protein isolates. Isolates are usually a little bit thinner in consistency. This one, the consistency was a slightly thicker, which personally, I enjoy. Uh, I'd rather have a milkshake versus a, you know, a watered down flavored chocolate. You know what I mean? So you can get one tub of Total ISO directly from their website for under $40, I believe, if you use our coupon code. I believe that takes off 11%. With that said, it's priced so slightly under 40 bucks. It is actually priced very competitively. Um, you get 29 servings per container. So you can do the math there. I'm sure you're an Einstein yourself. Uh, it's a solid deal. It's competitively, it's not the cheapest on the market, like I just said, but it's still fair. 
So overall, Cutler Nutrition, it is kind of just another protein powder on the market. They do have some cool flavors that they can tweak a little bit to make it better, but the flavor is still good. The effectiveness, you know, it's not gonna hurt your stomach. It's a very lean source of protein. It, you know, it's great for people who have dairy issues. You're not gonna get any bloating gas from it. The value is fair, the mixability is great. It's also slightly on the thicker side. Um, the taste is slightly sweet or slightly on the sweeter side. Uh, some people might not like that, but if you have a sweet tooth, you're gonna like it, especially the chocolate flavor. And once again, value is fair. So be sure to check us out on Facebook. Also. See you on the website.